G'day guys, it is a beautiful calm day out here at Waranga Basin, a rare sight indeed. I'm about to untie the kayak from the roof and paddle out there and try and find some redfin for a feed. Okay, I think she's all set up and ready to launch. Couple of things I'm doing different to when I was at Epilock. I've still got a size 3 stump jumper as my preferred trawling lure here um, but up I've got a dropper loop and a stinger with a strike tiger plastic on it just to give the fish another option while that's bumping along the bottom. I've got a second rod, a second rod I should say with a jiggle fishing plastic on there. Now that's if I find a school I can just drop that straight down beside the yak and bob up and down and try and catch a few in one go. Uh, what else have I got different? Oh, I self-made a little stringer there to give a go. I've never used one before, but if I catch some fish worth keeping today, I'm going to try attaching them to that and towing them around behind me. So we'll see how that goes. And of course, as last time, which I didn't mention, I'm wearing my bum bag life jacket. So I'll clip that on and we'll make our way out there. Oh, and the other thing I've changed today, swimsuit pants. I copped some shock and sunburn on my legs over at Epilock the other week, so that'll protect me. <laughs> oh, there was a bust up right there. Oh wow, okay. I'm not sure that they're big fish, but it might be worth having a cast with that plastic I've got tied on. Oh, I saw a fish following it. Looked a bit bigger than I expected to. Off to a good start here. The fish seem to be hungry. That's always a bonus when you're fishing. <laughs> oh, there was a touch. Come on, take it. Oh, come on. They might be too small for this plastic. Oh, they're, just, they're right there. They're following it in. Righto. Let's get out to a bit deeper water. I couldn't interest those little ones here. Probably too small for the plastic that I was flinging at them. But I'll go out somewhere where I can start trawling and try and find a school. Yes. Oh, I thought it was a fish. That was a fish. It's definitely a fish. Just trying to maintain a speed where I can see that rod tip constantly bouncing. Just really working that stump jumper. And I'm also trying to work it right about where it, ooh, where it starts hitting the bottom, as I was about to say. I don't want to go any shallower because I'm hitting bottom now. But I don't want to go any deeper either because I want to keep it right down there. So I'll try and follow that depth. It's been very quiet so far. I've trawled for maybe an hour and a half, two hours. And to my knowledge, well look, I think I had one hit, but I can't be sure that I didn't just tap some weeds or something down at the bottom. At the moment, I'm just trying to keep the rod on that side of me, because if I put it on that side, I can't see a damn thing. <laughs> Oh my god, I thought I was just in weeds, but I actually had a little red fin on there. <laughs> That's hilarious, I had no idea I was even hooked up. There we go, I had no idea he was even on there, I thought I had weeds. I hooked into him, he's a fat little bugger, and um, he didn't really fight. I thought I was just tapping through the weed bed, so I just thought I'll wind it up and pull all the weeds off, and I had this little ready on the end. So hopefully there's a school of them over there, but I'll troll back through and see if I can find another one. Normally I wouldn't keep one this small, but I was going to keep this one to fill it up and give the fish to my new chickens that I've got at home. But the way I've got my keeper stringer set up, 
I couldn't get it through his mouth and out his gills, so he gets to swim away today. See ya, buddy. Here we go. <laughs> Straight under the kayak. <laughs> right, well, I better not muck around. I'm going to troll back that way and see if I can find some more reddies. They've probably moved on by now, though, and how much I messed around then. Well, it has been super slow. I'm going to troll some shallower water. I've thrown on a little big W lure there. Same colours as the stump jumper because that's proven to work, but I'm going to hit some shallower water and hope that helps. And I've still got the jiggle fishing uh, little grub there as well. Fish on. That's decent fish. Bigger than the last one, is he? Oh my god. Oh, that's why. <laughs> Two in one. I got the daily double. Would you look at that? That's unreal. <laughs> no wonder it felt bigger. <laughs> Two in one. Alright, I'll unhook him. We'll have a look at both together. There's one off. This one's on trebles. Hopefully, I can get him off quickly enough. He should be right. Got some pliers there if I need. Oh, yep, he's unhooking himself at the moment. You flop around there for a sec, buddy. There you go. <laughs> the daily double. You ripper. No wonder he felt bigger than the last one. It's because there was two of him. <laughs> See you buddies. Awesome. Oh, there's a school over there then. As soon as they move their boat, I'll be heading back in that direction for sure. Alright, I have no idea where that school of fish has gone. So I'm going to go back to trawling. I might trawl up and back and around this area and see if I can find them again. Fish on again. Yep, definitely. <laughs> Found that school again, guys. They moved over here. Looks like he took the hard body. And he's probably the smallest one so far. <laughs> oh, there he goes. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> that was a good one. Right, oh, well, I'll troll back the direction I came from before and hopefully find the school again because I can't seem to cast to it. They only want it on the trawl. Yes. That is a fish, I believe. Awesome. Found them again. I'm running out of time though. It's, it's getting dark because of those clouds and I didn't bring a torch. Whoa, did I get a double up again? Got heavier all of a sudden. <laughs> no, just the one. See if I can land this on. Whoa, I'm out of I made practice at landing them in the kayak, but I've got him. Not the biggest for the day, probably the second biggest though. There you go. Another pretty little Waranga Basin redfin. You beauty. Alright, I'll put him back as well. They're all too small. See you mate. Come on. Let me get one more before I go. It's spewing there were no capers, but I'd be very happy just to catch another fish in the kayak. Yeah, a few little reddies. Nothing massive. Bit of fun though. Yeah. That feels like a fish. It's gotta be. Yes, I got one more before I went home. You ripper. There you go, that's what I'm getting. <laughs> that's about close to the biggest one. Yeah, <laughs> yeah they're tiny. Let's catch that just then. Yeah, just then, right here. Yeah. yeah. See you, mate. 
Well, that was a bit more productive than my trip over to Epilock the other week. I got one over there. I think I ended up with four or five here, including that double hookup, which was awesome. Uh, I better start packing up because I haven't got a torch and I've still got to tie the kayak on the roof and it's getting dark. <laughs> if you liked the video, give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment. I'll see you next time.